What is going on everybody? I am back with another video and today I didn't think I was gonna have to film this video anytime uh, Well, and for the next couple of days at least so I'm headed back to Charleston I've been home for spring break and that's actually where I filmed that hand sanitizer inks video They're gonna pop this lid and they're gonna smell immediately that this stuff works It's because I've been at home but I'm heading home because as you guys know this thing has caused the College of Charleston to... So we're gonna have online classes from next week till April 3rd, but now, and the governor of South Carolina even said this, we are canceling all class, in-person classes for the remainder of the semester. So everybody has to be out of the College of Charleston by Monday, but you guys know I'm an RA, so I'm going on back down tonight. I would have got up and gone down in the morning, but it'd just be easier for me to go down tonight, deal with less traffic, all that stuff. So. We're headed back to Charleston, and this video is definitely going to be take pl taking place over the next couple days. And me getting stuff moved out and everything. And I'll be starting online classes, though, uh, completely. I got to take off taking online classes. I'm taking one this semester. But everything's completely online for the remainder of the semester. So I'm probably, I don't know what that means for my job with an RA. Like, hopefully we ain't got to stay. I don't think we will. Um, but we might have to, um, well, we might not get paid the our full salary that we're supposed to get paid by the end of the year whatever with that the thing i was doing this summer might be getting canceled because of that who knows and hopefully this is actually gonna be gone soon so we don't know for sure but that thing i'll be doing this summer could be canceled um so i'm gonna have to talk to my bosses at my job back here at home um that i've had to see if i can work at least for the next couple like month or two but we'll figure this out anyways i gotta get down to charleston so i'll see you guys in a little bit i have never in my almost three years of pretty much living in Charleston and going back and forth between Charleston and Blacksburg seeing the interstate like this empty at any time of the day I've drove back and forth different times of the day and stuff like that but it's just it's crazy so I just got downtown and I apologize if there's like wind interfering I have my window rolled down but in my almost Three full years of living here and just in general I've never like seen this it this empty even out here at night especially like on a Thursday because like I don't go out on Thursdays I don't go out and party at all actually but like I know Thursdays like a party night for college students obviously there's spring break but like just in general college not college but uh, Charleston is usually just like full of people and like this is crazy this is on King Street right now. Like, this is the only, this is, I mean, I'm, King Street is literally this street, but like, that's the only place to open right now that involves food that I see at. Um, look at this, this restaurant, I've never seen this restaurant closed, or actually empty. That restaurant right there is closed. Um, it's crazy. It's just, and, I, and I've never seen King Street this empty, like people going across, ever. Ever. It's like the busiest street in Charleston. Look at this. So guys, I actually really gotta take a piss real quick. Hold on one second. So this is pretty much the plan for the next couple days. I'm gonna be down here helping them move out. That's my personal choice to help out and move out. It doesn't bother me. Uh, I feel like I've got a pretty good immune system and stuff, but I have to be out here by Monday. So besides that, it's kind of it. So I'm gonna just bring you guys along with me for the next couple days. It's gonna be like a jumpy vlog. Apologize for that, but yeah, I also need to film something to put up tomorrow, so. I'm gonna unpack, take a shower, and then figure some stuff out. What's up, everybody? Moved to the phone block because it's the next day, and I decided to walk outside. I want to see how much of a ghost town CFC or not CFC, but Charleston is. It won't be as in certain areas. I like the dorms and stuff because people are having to move out between today and Monday. I'm moving out Monday because I'm here to help if we need help. We'll see how much of a ghost town everything is. Let's go look.
like in one of the main points of campus, like there's classes in this building and this building. And then that's like where the president's office is back there. And there's the graduate class in the middle there. It's so empty, like there's a couple I think back there. The thing with they're not even college students. Like Charleston is a ghost town. Like I took a lap down King Street, came across at George, came into the main area over here, and walked through the like sister and stuff. You guys see it all. I've never seen it this empty, ever. Even on like hurricane evacuations and spring breaks and stuff. Like this is crazy. Return to campus coronavirus update number whatever. I don't know. I update number these. So after I actually went outside, when I went outside and showed you guys around campus, I actually just hadn't gotten done taking an exam. And besides that, all I've done today is eat, play PS4, and watch Seven Deadly Sins. Done nothing else all day. I tried to come up with some ideas for a video, but that's it. Nothing. I am doing something tomorrow. You guys will enjoy that. Something to do when you're quarantined. Well, I'm not quarantined. I'm kind of down here till I can leave Monday, so tomorrow's Saturday. <sighs> so, anyways. Yeah. I actually need to start emptying out the room. If you guys can't tell. I have to get that down, that down, that down. That's what I brought back with me. Some clothes in that bag. Mainly shorts and a t-shirt. Um, I gotta get all that down. And then, um, yeah. But we're gonna wait and do that. Um, yeah, that's been the update for now. I think I know what I want to film tomorrow, and I will turn that into a video itself, and probably not do that separate from this, so we'll see. It's barely been any time since I filmed that clip. Like, I'm, I'm literally watching the same episode, and why do we have a fire alarm during this? So, so, um, I just got done shooting guns and I realized it wasn't enough for a video, so I'm gonna let you guys see this right here of uh, the gun shooting, so. Josh is still sleeping. Jeez! All right. All right. Holy crap. Jeez, Josh. Hey, Good job. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that gun shooting. Now, um, while we were shooting guns, um, this guy that we were shooting with, so um, a little background. The guy that we were shooting with is a guy who was uh, one of Corey's supporters because he works for a campus ministry and they don't have a salary they have to raise for their funds and this guy supports him. Anyways, we're out on his land shooting and um, he's a doctor. I don't, know, I, mean, I don't know if that really gives any extra to the background, but he um, pretty much said, I had got a text say there might be a statewide lockdown because of coronavirus tomorrow. Um, so, uh, I told my parents and they were talking and then we were trying to figure stuff out. I'm probably not going to have one. The governor said we're not going to. My mom saw where the governor said there wasn't going to be one, but there might. But either way, I'm probably just going to go ahead and leave Charleston tomorrow. So I got to get rid and go ahead and start unpacking or start packing up. Okay, so this is how the room will be clean by the time y'all see it next. So. Okay, so, next morning, only things left hanging up in my room were that, that poster and those lights, I use those lights, eh. But, it's empty now, and if you can't tell, there's an echo. Well, you probably can't tell, but it echoes now that nothing's on the walls. So, the statewide lockdown might not be taking place now, to at least today. The governor came out with a statement yesterday saying, yesterday saying that probably, they're trying not to do one. So, yeah. Also, this is the only hoodie I don't have packed and it doesn't match my 
shorts at all. But so it looks weird if I walk outside. But it's not gonna happen, so I'm here till Monday because I also can't get my desk shifts covered tomorrow. So sucks. And today is also the last day of spring break, technically, even though I don't have any schoolwork to do because I did all my work. I didn't have much, and what I did do, I spread out like that was one thing. I spread it out like a little bit each day. There's that. So for now. Watch for more Seven Deadly Sins, and probably going to figure out what to do for like a video or something today. I'm just looking at that to see if I had any homework assignment and stuff to do, but I don't. So, anyways, let's update what it, number or whatever of quarantine stuff. So, first day of full online classes for the semester. It's actually going on right now for my first class of the day. The image. So there's two ways to do that. One way is that you can just using the generate a. This is the way. What's up, everybody? So I'm at the desk now. My last desk shift before I leave for the quarantine. I work till three. It's 105, and there's literally nothing to do. I did my classes for the day. Don't have any schoolwork. And probably won't have any score to my class I have tomorrow, so we'll see. But I'm at the desk and I've never actually filmed behind the desk, but literally nothing's going on. Like, I don't have to do anything but other just watch people come back and forth and we're allowed to have technology at the desk, so I'm on YouTube about to watch something. But I guess I finally show you guys what it's like behind the desk, even though I've, I've, and I've worked here over a year. So there's nothing really important except for like on this side over there. There's no like over there, so I'm not gonna show you guys that because it's got no phone numbers and stuff. But it's literally it. So I'm watching YouTube, actually, Mr. Beast in a video. Normally, I have this website put up on this computer. We're not allowed to have these here, actually, except for on for our building Saturdays and Sundays. But they lifted that, and I'm allowed to be on it. Also, people have been coming in and out of here, just like doing all their stuff and like getting getting moved out and I'm here for the next two hours just kind of watching. So time to watch some YouTube and chill. <sighs> well, really echoes in my room now. Um, this is the, gonna be the end of the video, guys. My Calister 318A, you were a good room for eight months. I'm gonna miss you. Uh, this looks really weird. I'm actually gonna have a different setup next year. I'm coming back to my Calister, but it's empty, it's empty, empty. Everything's gone, the only thing's left is like Probably the stuff he had there. So that's gonna be the end of the video for me, guys. This is kind of what it looked like to get moved out and situated uh, after getting told three or four days ago that we had to be out by today. So, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, why don't you guys hit the subscribe button like this? Uh, subscribe, join the family. If you haven't already, hit the post notification bell. It looks like this, so you guys get notified when new videos come out. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.